life was tragically taken in a way that Angelina did not deserve. Now on Night Beat, a young life cut short while home on winter break. Tonight, police looking for the driver that hit and killed an SF State student. Good evening, I'm Juliet Goodrich. And I'm Brian Hackney. Night Beat's Joe Vasquez is live at SF State with what we're learning about the victim. Joe? Brian, the victim was a junior here at San Francisco State University. She was down in Los Angeles County visiting family when she was killed. Tonight, more than 100 people gathered in Rosemead in Southern California to remember Angelina Pinedo. Angelina spent every moment she possibly could with her family and friends. She was beloved by everyone who knew her. The 21-year-old San Francisco State student was with her sister walking in a crosswalk last night, leaving a party in Redondo Beach when police say an SUV killed her and the driver kept going. Last night, her life was tragically taken in a way that Angelina did not deserve. Her family says Angelina was a toddler, about two years old, when she lost her own father in the same way, a hit-and-run crash. Her mother died shortly thereafter. <laughs> Her aunt and uncle adopted Angelina as their own and raised her in the town of Rosemead. My baby sister had the most amazing soul. And I wouldn't be surprised if she would be here telling me to forgive that person. A junior at San Francisco State, Angelina recently worked as a resident assistant in a dorm. Among her various part-time jobs was a stint at this Daily City restaurant not far from campus. Her family says she was studying sociology so she could help children. Since tomorrow's the first day back to school from the winter break, her brother-in-law tells me Angelina planned to catch the Greyhound bus last night back to San Francisco. Uh, I think it's very tragic because, like, I've had family members in the past. Like, they've gotten hit and run, and they don't know who it is, so it's very sad. Like, they're just thinking about all these thoughts of, like, who killed my daughter or son, and they're just they're left with, like, no answers. Police are hoping the public will be on the lookout for a black Audi Q5 with a partial plate of 7MB. The family hopes the driver will turn himself in. Please, we're just asking you to give our family the peace that they deserve, to give her the peace she deserves. Word of Angelina's death is just now trickling in here at San Francisco State. Her family says that anyone who knew her knew she was the type of person who would give anyone in need the shirt off her back. Reporting live, Joe Vasquez, back to you.